So first and foremost, I want to give all praises to you. How about him? You are shy. How about him? Look out for that. Oh, the blunders to the elders and apostles of James Greatness to all and shall warm to all your cams out there pushing this world in sincerity and in truth. Um, this is Brother Dawabar from the Jamaica JMS camp here to do a short video um, based on an article I saw on Instagram posted by the Jamaica Star. Right? It, the title is Man Blames God for a Crime in Clarendon. Right? It says, God is to be blamed for all the criminal activities in Clarendon and other parts of the world, says Michael Lambert, who claims he is an atheist. <laughs> he said that he, he lost confidence in the Christian faith and believed that his teaching about the Almighty are nothing but myths. Well, basically, I'm right, because what Christians teach him what is legit don't make no sense, that's so why he can come out and say such such things, right? The Almighty, the Almighty does create evil in the earth, right? That he make it for fame purpose, right? And based upon the facts that you them don't understand, as you mean the scriptures, right? Them, them basically lost to it. So basically, just I'll get into a quick scripture, right? Uh, Proverbs. Proverbs 16 and 4. Alright, this is Proverbs 16 and 4. It says, The Lord had made all things for himself, yea, even the wicked for the day of evil. So, right? So, basically, the Almighty make everything. So, basically, the man we had the, 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 the crime, the spirit was created by the Almighty to do such specific tasks, right? Because we are the master of all spirits, basically. Right, all spirit is subjected unto him, right? But but people don't understand that. So basically them them go off basically and are destroyed for lack from lack of knowledge, right? You can get that precept there quickly to this child of Hosea. See, Hosea four and six. My people are destroyed for a lack, for a lack of knowledge because they had reject, no, rejected knowledge. I will also reject thee, that thou shalt be no priest to me, seeing thou hast forgotten the laws of, the, of thy God. I will also forget thy children. So the scripture says, oh, my people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. Basically, that are up nowadays, right? Them don't have the, the knowledge of the scriptures, right? Them basically apply for them own judgment. And no go off a judgment of the scriptures, right? And that basically skip the, the, the Christians them do nowadays, right? Back in our article, we say God never make we write from long time. Well, that that's a stupidness, right? The Almighty make it for good away, here, right? Good and evil, duality. You now that we have good, you have to have evil, and then create both sides. And that you don't understand the Christian teaches that the Almighty, which his name is Yahweh. And him son name is Yahweh Shai, right? Them teach that him all good, which the scripture don't say that, right? This the scripture say totally different from what them teach, and we can get into some scriptures to even back that point, right? Now, this is Deuteronomy 32 and 39, all right? So I say. So know that I, even I, am he, and there is no other God with me. I kill and I make alive. I wound and I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver you out of my hands. Right? So when we get in an article even more, right, you are going to see some comments that talk about the devil real and thing, but not knowing, say, yo, the devil is under the control of the Almighty, right? Him just the on the left hand side. Right. Uh, and that is why mankind arts are evil. <laughs> Basically, the, we we just under punishment. That's why we do so much unrighteousness, right? Because we are of the we we we're in a flesh, right? Which is a punishment. We in a form of flesh, so we naturally we are gonna do unrighteousness 
unrighteous things because that our way flesh makes for the flesh itself unrighteous and the flesh go against the spirit daily the spirit of the, the good side with the flesh of the bad side right so basically we, the flesh go against the spirit every day this pure wickedness are happen in Clarendon and other places where it's supposed to go so because again the almighty said all things right and in order fear of good or fear of evil which is duality and the almighty said it so right all a part of theme movie right why when the man them are going rob a man and kill him God not change them mind and make them go hug up the man or woman and tell them say them love them exactly because it's supposed to go so the next thing is that we're supposed to die because we are sin so the thing about god is our love is wrong because the almighty basically jack of people daily see sin right because scripture say oh See this transgression of the laws, is it me? We have 613 laws, and two third of our people now keep that in mind. Two third of our people don't even know, majority of people don't even know um, the first 10 commandments, right? Majority of people don't know the first, the, the 10 commandments, I should say, because them, them set them own standards towards God, right? Them tell themselves, say, yo, basically. God do this and God do that. Them, them not read the scriptures and underst try understand how the Heavenly Father work. Them set them own standards to him, right? Which is wrong. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying oh, God not change them mind and make them go up up the man. Well, they're not supposed to go, sir. They're supposed to die. Basically, and the one where applied judgment to them, I go get fiend judgment to, right? Because I said the Almighty work, right? And you know, uh, God perish innocently we get that in a job right. job four seven So the scripture says, remember, remember, I pray thee, whoever perish being innocent, or where, oh God, just lucky about that. Alright, it's lucky, alright, it highlighted now. Remember, I pray thee, whoever perish being innocent, or where, where the righteous got off, basically. The scripture, this is scripture here. straightforward, right? The scripture says, whoever, whoever perish being innocent, nobody not perish being innocent, right? Because nobody not innocent to sin daily again. There is not a sinless day in a, the kingdom here we do know. Not a sinless day. We sin daily and the wages of sin is dead, right? We're supposed to die. We Okay. Right, this is Roman Romans six and twenty three. See scripture. So, for the wages of sin is dead, but the gift of Yahweh is eternal life through Yahweh Shia Mashiach. Right? And people don't people don't have this truth. Right? The gift of life are basically the Holy Spirit, right? To understand the the, 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 the truth, right? This knowledge basically. Right? And most people don't have that. Right? But the main point is the wages of sin is dead, basically. All are we supposed to be dead? Right? Because we sin daily, but we are under grace. So the Almighty will give you time to repent. And this is why them people here don't understand. That's why the motor make some stupid comments and, and I write them stupidness. Yes, the Almighty create evil. Right? For fiend purpose. Right? But them don't un them don't understand that. Them basically talk for them stupidness or, or as well the Christian them they judge it from for them standpoint. That's why atheists can um hoof Christians so with some simple something. 
right? And Christians can't fight back because they don't understand the scriptures. As the elder them would have said, this was not given unto them. The Almighty not deal with them, right? So why him not change their mind and make them go have a drink together? <laughs> the crime rate will go up and make sure him see it. <laughs> him cause it. So why him not do nothing about it, Lambert said? Because him done. Right to him, right? And everything is in perfect order. Nothing, nothing out of place. People talk like the Almighty sit down, I watch TV, and then something bad happen and then just get up and say oh, oh shit that pass or is it me or everybody have free will no everybody not have free will the almighty write him script and we're just the actors them towards it right the almighty no said this man did go go so boom and write one article upon this because i am set it so right everything set in a perfect order by the almighty nothing is out of place everything Set for a reason, for him reason, not for we. So we know them stupidness are basically, you see me? I just the misunderstanding or lack of knowledge of people have, right? So a lot of people now go agree with me. But if God did exist, we don't understand why he would allow all the bad things that are um, long time to continue because of him set it so. Get the next scripture. Is it 45 and 7? So, Isaiah 45 and 7. Say, so, oh. Alright. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, do all these things. Exactly. And that Him set it for. No other reason, right? Him do him feel like because I am the Almighty, I'm the Alpha and Omega, right? My my Creator, him do him feel like we're not supposed to uh, say yo why God do this or a question him or uh, say yo God this and God that. You see me? This is why in scripture say and people feel to understand this. That's why them lost. That's how people lost today. Right? And I gonna get totally annihilated by him. Because we go off, right? And we don't want to return to we, we, um, the Heavenly Father ways, right? We, we basically gone off completely. And you have um, brothers in the highways and byways that teach, and instead of them try to learn something, they're out there a scoff, right? They're out there a, a push the word away, right? So Jeremiah 6 and 16, he said, Thus, Say the Lord, stand ye in the ways and see and ask for the old parts. Basically, the, 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 the laws, the, the heavenly father ways, we you ask for them and say, where is the good way and walk therein? We're supposed to walk, we're supposed to seek for walking in the heavenly father ways and not the way of this world because the scripture also said there is a way that seemeth right unto a man and that the, the end thereof is um, death. I'm just paraphrasing the scripture, right? And ye shall find rest for your souls. So the only way that you are going to find rest. Right? This are, this are the comforter. This are, this are the main comforter for with the scriptures. Right? Everything we have to do with life in the scripture. In, a, in a, the apocryphal tell us how the Almighty had, had sent straight. Um, oh God. You need to get me apocrypha. Slack here, mate. Second Ezra. Right, second Ezra seven and twenty. For there be many that perish in this life because they despise the law, the laws of your power that is set before them. So the scripture tell you, right? So yo, the people um basically despise the laws of the heavenly father. So basically that's why so much of them are dead because them don't don't actually try rehearse the laws, right? Twenty one for Yahweh had said I had given straight commandments to such as came that what they should do to live even as they came and what they should observe to avoid punishment. Right? 
And the same thing with the scripture said before, it's a wages of sin is death. If we did have followed the laws, then me, then we wouldn't have to die, you know? We wouldn't have got through punishment if we did actually follow the laws, but with people like go off, right? Back to the scripture, Jeremiah 6 and 16, just say, The Lord stand in the ways and see, and see ask for the old parts, where is the good way, and walk therein, and ye shall find rest for your soul. But they say we will not walk therein, right? Mm -hmm. That what people are do basically because you have brothers out there in the highways and the byways where actually uh, push this word and people actually uh, scoff or come to them and talk about uh, stupidness, right? And uh, denounce the brother them are, are uh, basically this the brother them out in, uh, in uh, the highways, right? So, let's get in a few of them comments here. What's the name? See, the person will say, oh, if God is real, the devil is real, everyone is entitled to their own choice. No, everybody is entitled to their own choice. Not everyone makes the right choice. No, the Almighty set it the way they're supposed to go off so him can have mercy upon you. If you don't go off, him cannot have mercy upon you, eh? right? There would be no need for mercy, right? Him set it so. Yeah. Half it the way where him sit. I know you have no choice, right? Uh, you know, have no choice in, in a this, right? So if if people would just stop for a moment and listen, they will hear from God. But everyone is so revengeful and angry all the time. How can it be? Uh, the Almighty set it away. They have spirits out there where him send for them, them birthday, right? I um, got almost 3 and 6 real quick. Right. So, you uh, must chance it shall a trumpet be blown in the city, and the people not be afraid? Shall there be evil in a city, and the Lord hath not done it? Right. Again, the scripture is straightforward with these points, right? The Almighty does everything. He controls both sides, right? It is Yahweh, the Heavenly Father, right? He controls everything. He no go to nobody else. He no have no. He no have no opposite to him. He no have nobody where basically, uh, uh, I do the opposite. I wear him do. It's like yeah, right? In a job, he ma he actually he actually give the go ahead to to. Satan for go and tempt Job, right? If if we da read the scriptures then we'd understand them thing. Then. If if we people that read the scriptures then then them would understand them thing then. But as the elders them said the Almighty not dealing with them, right? So can any thought that you know? Someone give all praises to you how about Shem Yavashai, Bashem Lakakodash, double and nice to the elders and apostles of James Great Men Stone and Shalom to all the Akims out there pushing this word in sincerity and in truth.